I'm always fascinated to learn the stories behind legendary people. How did the great thinkers, leaders, and artists of history become who they were? Inevitably, I discover they didn't make it on their own. There was always someone behind them, supporting them, offering encouragement when they needed it most. But we forget about the ones who helped along the way. So it's nice sometimes to get a little reminder. No one succeeds alone. Everyone needs the support and faith of at least one person in his life. In the late 1840s, Nathaniel Hawthorne, in dire financial straits, took a position as surveyor of a custom house. But the demands of his new job and young family required all of his time. During these years, he managed to write only three stories, for which he earned a grand total of $25. Then, in June of 1849, Nathaniel lost his politically appointed job when a new administration was elected in Washington. In despair, Nathaniel returned home to break the terrible news to his wife Sophia. They had no savings, no prospects for more work. But Nathaniel was caught by surprise when his wife exclaimed, Now you have the time to write your book. And what shall we live on while I am writing it, he replied. Sophia then went to her keepsake box and removed a rather large sum of money. She told him, I have always believed in my heart that someday you would write a masterpiece, if only you had the opportunity. Out of the money you gave me for the household, I put aside a small amount each week. This is enough for us to live on for a while. This is your opportunity. I believed in you when we met, and I believe in you now. Soon after, Nathaniel Hawthorne began work on a novel. Five months later, with Sophia's savings, love, and encouragement, the book was completed. That book was titled, The Scarlet Letter. <laughs> 